Hello, this is Christopher. Welcome to another video. And today I'll be showing you guys how to make like a um, like basically a um, kind of like those doors and jump weight, whatever. Um, like basically like um, key card only doors. I that's not a spell container. Um, Um, so yeah, but sadly you will need 25 Robux to do this, um, you basically want to get, um, the Tor Grip plugin for, um, 25 Robux, as you can see I actually got it, um, so and then, yeah, so I actually made a kit for this, I'll leave the description to the kit in the, um, description below um and then i also be um showing you guys like how to make like the key card and stuff so what i would rather do is like i'll get like a um this is the key card i made so i would like get um like a neon that color or whatever then this part then just like do something like this if you want you can make a like darker like that or like I don't like it like that. Oh god, that actually hurts my eyes. Um, but like, you could do really any color you want. Um, but I'm going to use be like, using like this dark blue one. Right here. So yeah. Now you basically want to like, um, scale it down to like the size you will want it. So I'm going to make like a basic key card to be like this. And then make sure you see like up a tiny bit like this well actually you want to keep it down for now so now just simply duplicate it then once you duplicated it well you can make your own key card but i'm just going to show you guys like key card i personally want or what i would make or what i did make i should say so now that you did this you want to make this this black up here then you want to go to like the key card thing to like the sides and scale it up a tiny bit then once you see the the black one it should be lower than the key card by just a tiny bit and then you want to make sure that it's scaled out a tiny bit like that so like you cannot see like the thing glitching out then scale it down all the way Um, and then you want to do the same for the other side. Just like this. So boom. Now that I did this, guys, it kind of can be like a key card. This kind of looks like a key card. Um, but basically once you did this, you want to hook, um, do, like, just hover over like this. Go to model, then simply press onion. Then, as you can see, guys, it's now one part. You can undo this if you actually did it too late by just pressing the undo button. So basically, now that you got the onion, onion, I want to call it handle, just like this. Then you want to go to starter pack, do a tool. And then put the handle and the tool. So now basically you got the tool thing set up. And you do not want to put any scripts in here. Okay. Now you basically just like want the door. Like you just want to make a door. So for this. For the sake of the video. Um, I'll just do like no more door like this. Um, just very simple door. And you can also, um, I also like to test your stuff, like your tools and stuff, and put on the wig. Like, as you can see, this tool, guys, isn't, like, good. This is where the, like, Robux thing would come in. 
So okay. now you simply want to put this in solder pack. Then you want to go to that plugin you made. Then as you can see guys, it should basically look like this. Edit to grip. Then you basically will want to make it. Wait, why did I undo that actually? I have no idea guys what happened. Um maybe we should like delete this rig really quick. But you should keep the O egg. Oh, because it's not a player lol. So basically you just like want to put like a rig down the name of like tool tester um wig so basically once you did this as you can see we put the tool in uh, uh, my thing is like kind of already done but as you can see guys it'll look like this so far and this is kind of like what you would kind of have so basically you want to like basically like doing like an R15 one I think Oh, well, actually, you cannot move these arms. Um, so, Come on. Um, so basically, now once you did this, you want to um get the tool and put it back in the um, solder pack. Then basically, you want to close the test rig. Then get the tool. The tool grip. Then select the tool. Then edit the grip. I don't know why it keeps going to this rig. Um, but guys, as you can see, whatever. Um, actually, I should probably get rid of this rig. I think of it. Delete the rig. Delete rig. Why can't I delete my rig? Okay, there we go. Now we can do the tool. Okay, this keeps glitching. Um, oh, I know. Well, you basically can name it whatever you want. But, like, yeah, if it glitches like that, you can always go into toolbox, type in, um, um, what was it called? For Chris's, um, key card door kit. And it should pop up right here. All these ones don't really, really work. As you can see, guys, these are all my kits. Um, well, these are some of my kits there. Um, then you basically want to click on this one. Um. Then, as you can see, guys, it should have a key card there. This key card I'm pretty sure is edited already with the plugin. Um, but as you can see, guys, we should get the plugin on. Then, um, as well, it can be a little glitchy, guys. Just keep that in mind. Um, but yeah. So, uh, you basically just like really want to like just like um move this tool to start the pack. Then you want to put this in the door. This is basically the script. Right here. Then you basically want to put the door into workspace. Then delete the thing. So now that you have the key card, when you press play. So now once you press play, um Oh god, I forgot to anchor it. Basically, you want to anchor it, but as you can see, we should get the key card. I actually have to fix that. We get the key card, as you can see, guys, we cannot go in, no matter what you think. But if you get the key card, as you can see, I got a quick goof. Probably said the last video. But boom. It only lasts for one second, but you could change it in the script. Um, and this is, I was also kind of thinking of this, um, but, like, I don't really think it would have worked. 
like I could have done like a black hole. You can actually make like a hammer, and then you can have like a building, and then like you could do like nine 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 nine. And then you'd like basically just get the hammer when you touch the building, it explodes. Um, but basically, what I did was, um, it only took me about five minutes to do. It only took me like a minute to do with the kit, but this dry didn't like they didn't even take me that long. So, like, if you put something else here, it probably would not work. But, but like if you make this tool like something else, it will not work because this is the tool name and then the tool name is the item that will do it. Um, and then also guys, make sure to um, like the video um, because next video I'll be showing you guys like how to make, oh uh, what was it called? Like how to make kind of like a um basically make um like an opening door animation so like when you um like when you open the door with the key card the door will swing open just like in jailbreak so i hope you guys enjoyed the video um make sure to like and subscribe and that and if this video gets about a eh, 100 views maybe i do that um tutorial make sure you check out the um the simulator map tutorials those help me make my sim simulator map that i was doing in the videos you can find those on my profile and, um so yeah hope you guys enjoyed the video like and subscribe and see you in the next one bye